One of Roblox's most popular game genres is horror. In this video, I'll go through 10 of the best horror games on Roblox. This first game is called FNAF Coop. This is a game that has remade most of the Five Nights at Freddy's games to have online co-op and the ability to move freely. If you liked FNAF in any way, you are going to love this game. The second game is called Frigid Dusk. It's a game that takes place in an old laboratory where you must uncover the secrets of a mysterious experiment gone wrong. It has two chapters, chapter one has three parts, and chapter two has two parts with a third in development. The third game is called The Intruder. This game is all about keeping yourself safe from an intruder breaking into your home and various other places in later levels. You can play the game single player or multiplayer and it has tons of unique features like anxiety and awareness meters that affect how you can play the game. The fourth game is called Dead Silence. In this game, you are investigating the disappearance of a police officer. You start the game in a sewer where you quickly realize that nothing is as it seems. With terrifying killers, scary locations, and a sense of dread and panic, you can play by yourself or with up to three other people. The fifth game is called Cheese Escape. The title explains the game pretty well. You have to go through a large maze while collecting cheese and keys. You must do all of this while avoiding the giant mouse that's chasing you. This game is much more goofy than the others on the list, and it may not even count as a true horror game, but I still recommend you play it as it's super fun both by yourself and with a group of friends. The sixth game is called The Mimic, and it's one of the best made horror games on Roblox. The Mimic has two main storylines called books. One book is called Control that has four chapters, and one is called Jealousy that has three chapters. The finished game will have four books in total, and they are always working on new updates. This game is based on Japanese history and urban legends, with horrifying twists that make for some really scary experiences. The seventh game is called Bunny Tail, and while it may look like a completely innocent game about saving cute little bunnies from a cute little town called Dreamville, it's anything but innocent. It's a single player horror game that gets really dark, eerie, and gruesome. If you like horror, you'll definitely love this game. The eighth game is called The Backrooms Redacted. If you're familiar with the backrooms at all, then you're going to love this game. The game is pretty simple. You have to traverse a series of different empty buildings called liminal spaces, whilst usually avoiding frightening creatures that stalk you throughout the maze. There are tons of good Backrooms games on Roblox, but I would recommend the one by Theo Godino. The ninth game is called 3008. This is a super popular game that takes place in a large furniture store. You have to survive the night when the employees turn evil. You can build bases with the items, and you can eat food to regain health and stamina. Overall, this one is super fun to play with friends. The last game is arguably the most popular on this list, and it's called Doors. Doors is a seriously addicting puzzle horror game that tries to get you to escape all the doors of a scary hotel. If you enjoy puzzles and strategy mixed with your horror, then you'll absolutely love this game. A good thing about Doors is that you can play it a million times and never get bored because of the randomly generated obstacles. I highly recommend this one and you can play it either by yourself or with three other people. And those were just 10 out of the millions of fantastic horror games that you can find on Roblox. There are a lot more, so if you're interested, leave a comment down below. We may make another video about this. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and thank you so much for watching.